Hey guys, it's Tidy Beats here and welcome back to another video. I was supposed to make this yesterday, but I mean I forgot. I was too busy working on this and I actually I bought this recently off for about um £14.50 and look what's all that's wrong with it. Shattered screen. I've actually got the replacement digitizer and that to fix it, but I forgot to get the fucking bezel, so that'll be hopefully be arriving tomorrow so I can do that. But yeah, I got asked to make this video recently um by one of my subscribers actually and i really forgot uh his name so give me a sec why is it going to youtube studio i just want youtubes and we'll f i've forgotten his name but we'll think we'll find we'll find out guys no worries I'm not that mean. I have to give credit to where credit was due. Plus, I really wanted to know all about this as well because I didn't know anything about it until he, until I got mentioned. Let's just go down and all my shit. Hollow snake. Is it a hollow snake? I'm say. Yeah. 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 I know the video's a bit zoomed in. Looks good. That's not what we're here for, though, is it? Uh, is my gonna load? It's not like my internet shit. My comments gonna load. I'll be a cunt. Friend shit. There we go. Um. Yeah. Inf Hollow Snake was on about was on about it in the comments asking about the modding on the quest. So here's what's up. Uh, on the Beat Saber Discord, if I just go uh, there or whatever, it's because I don't know how to save the world. Um, sad news: Fockless Quest Beat Saber players, the developers on Beat Honor dropped support on for Beat Honor no longer. And is and it is no longer available f through side quests. The decision the decision was made. New legal language was added to the quest to protect developers from their mods. Elect whatever mods. Uh, Oculus made it clear that their uh, was up to developer was up to developer. Beat Beat Games was unable to give. Be on permission to mod their game, so be on, so the be on team decided to end development. Oculus or Beat Games did not force the de this decision on the developers of Be on. This de this decision was made on the Be on's Be on's team own free will and will not, and it was not forced down. Do, be patient. Wait for another quest modding tool. We'll get to that in a sec. Um, things like this have happened before. Never stop and never stop modding. Is simply a minor step, but that's that's true. That happened a lot with um, the original mod tool, actually, because that was down for a, about a couple of weeks. Uh, Try to spread the message. Misinformation has been spreading throughout the community. And, and the more people who understand the situation, the better everything will turn out. Take time to thank the original beat on team. Uncountable hours spending on spending modding and all the and they deserve all the thanks in the world for their hard work. Do not leave negative feedback for beat negative reviews for Beat Saber because this because of this or harass develop, developers of beat games because of modding. This does this does nothing to harm our relationship with them and does nothing to improve this. It's true. Nothing. I've seen so many like comments uh, being like, fuck you, beat, beat games for fucking up our mods. It's not their fault, guys. Like, they don't have control of the mods. Mods, the, mods don't exist to them, if that makes sense. Like, it's not a part of their game. Like, mods are mods. Mods will always be modifications. And harass 
And then the other thing, harass the developers of Beat On for dropping support. Develop developing mods to the quest is somewhat of a legal risk, and is not, and it is not under unrespond um, unreasonable for them to drop support out of le fear of legal action. Do not harass the Beat On team. It's unproductive and fixes nothing if you wish to keep using uh, quest mods do not update the, the game until new modding tools are available update will be posted here sort of thing now this is where we get to the good ship it would have <coughs> when was this this was uploaded mon uh, last monday this was uploaded last wednesday two days later it would appear that a, that a blessing of unicorns has put their hooves to work and despite not having oppose opposable thumbs, have created the be the Beat Saber. What's that? Beats BF. The BMF, BMBF, a tool that is easily easily mod Beat Saber on the Oculus Quest and add custom songs. So that's already back, guys. I wish I could give you more and ins more insight as how they managed to do that, but I have very little information. However, they have aforementioned blessing allowed me to review the source code to see that it is in fact legit. I'll screenshot the you know below. Always, if you like to jump into quest modding, here's the. Here's the release for it. I'll go over that in a minute. I don't have a quest, so I can't test it, but I can see what we can do. You could use the BMF, uh, BMBF installer to easily install the program onto your quest, or the BMF, BMBF uh, package for APK file, which is if you decide like to sign, uh, side load it manually. And this is just basically going. A blessing of anonymous unicorns have collected, collectively made our offering to the questions. Oh, I love that. That's cool. Um, in the wake of emulator unfortunately disappearance, we have taken up the task of maintaining mod loader for the masses, and for their trust, we would like your like your review here's a link to our source archive and some build sort of thing yeah buddy but it's looking at it it's all available let's just see how this runs because i've never opened this i've not got a quest so i can't actually check it myself but we'll see what we can do eh yay news yeah it's just it's just downloading guys here we go Right, just give me a sec. Let me just make up a new folder on my desktop. Because I will eventually be getting a quest, so I'm going to need this. And then I'll show you guys how to mod it eventually when I can do it. I doubt any of this will properly run on my PC. Oh! Enables uh, custom songs for loading quests. So I guess you do that. Then install Beat Saber in your headset. This game, this modifies the game and can result in decreased performance. Yeah, I can't do much here, guys, considering I don't have a headset. But this is all it is, sort of thing. I guess you activate that and it does all of it. Shit, I'm not sure. But yeah, that's how you do that. If you want the link for this, I can put it in the description if you guys want. I probably will anyway. But um, there you go. Actually, I'll just so you know it's legit. I'll copy that now. I'll copy that now, so I've got it for linking it in the description. Um, but there's that, guys. That's that. I thought I'd just keep you up to date on what's going on. And I don't know if I'll be uploading Beat Saber today because I'm probably going to be busy with this, just messing around on this for a bit more because I've jailbroken it and everything. And it is only a second gen iPad, 2012, like mid model. But I've jailbroken it and I've got all my tweaks. Like, I've actually seen, I don't know how, but I've sped it up a bit. So it's not that laggy, sort of thing, on iOS 9.3.5. So that's working all right. But if anyone knows how to uh, iCloud bypass a iPod Touch 50, let me know, because I might need your help. 
Anyway, guys, I'll see you guys later, and peace out. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!